Hello everyone, this is Luke again, and welcome back to yet another Ninjago video onto the channel today. So, well, this is going to be another general Ninjago discussion, it, well, let's like bring it back. So, um, a big issue that I'm having with this new Ninjago, um, is to put it simply, I feel like it's being really, really lazy. And why do I think that? Well, one of the reasons why I think that is because they constantly keep using the same villains over and over and over again. They keep using snakes! And it's really pissing me off. And this is, if you don't know what I'm referring to, Season 15's poster got recently got leaked. And, well, apparently the villain army is supposed to be yet another snake villain bunch. What in the literal hell? This can't be any more unoriginal than this. I understand that the serpentine and snakes have a huge history with Ninjago and stuff like that, but this is just... Borderline, this is the definition of unoriginal and lazy. So, if you want to go over the history of snakes, let me go through your quick path. Season 1, we had the Serpentine. They were a new concept at the time, so at the time, they received fairly well. And are still, fail, still received well to this day. Next up in 2015, four years later, we got the fake... Anachondri or the Anachondri cultists. And they weren't really true Anachondri, as mentioned by Pythor, just fakes. But they still count since they really did look like snakes. And since they weren't originally snakes, that makes it made them stand out. Next, in 2017, we got the Vermilion Warriors. Now, unlike the Serpentine, which were their own separate tribes, the Vermilion was actually the spawn of the Great Devourer, the one thing the Serpentine feared. So, in a sense, you could label the Vermilion as its own tribe, but it feels like it's not really smaller than that. Um, and they did have this cool regeneration ability where if you get, where if you hit them out at the uh, the the armor, they'll just fuse back up into what they looked like last time. So you would have to do some combo move in order to get fully make them scatter away, which that makes them unique in that regard. But I feel like this point, this is where it started to get a little bit repetitive. And then, and then two years later, we got we got the Pyro Vipers, and this army was pretty pretty useless as they only appear for like five episodes and Ellie and they were kind of original because they were mummies and they possessed fire and because they possessed fire so at least they were somewhat original in that sense but this is where it was really really getting annoying it was like come on you couldn't think of anything else and now we have, in 2021, the Hydra Whippers, which is a complete, which is even lazier than the Pyro Vipers. Because this is literally just reskinning, retooling, photoshopping, and just renaming the Pyro Vipers into, or, or Pyro Whippers into Hydra Whippers, or Hydra Vipers, whatever. That's complete and utter laziness, in my opinion. You can't get more unoriginal than that. This is where I am literally just furious. Like, there's no excuse for this as well. Especially considering Nexonites, one of Nexonites' uh, biggest weaknesses was that they kept using the same villain throughout its four seasons of runtime. And they, they were going to switch to a new villain by the fifth season, but that never happened. And Nexo Knights got cancelled before or that season could happen. And I have a feeling that because they use the same villain over and over and over again, along with its declining set sales, had a, a role in that. So, 
And this is what I don't want Ninjago to happen. I don't want it to fall under that line of using the same villains again and again and again. When it's proven in the past that it can use way many other types of villains. It's used human villains and even gods at one point as villains. So there's no excuse for them using this again. And this is just making me incredibly mad. And I really need to calm down after this video. But anyways... What do you guys think? Do you think Ninjago needs to stop using snakes forever, or at least for the next five years? <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below. But anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel by clicking on that red subscribe button, and clicking on the notification button to see every video that I will upload. And I'll see all you folks in the next video. Bye-bye!